Oh yeah, hi. This is Sea Lavier reporting back into YouTube. Er, uh, probably can't. I'm on the blue Mustang, the blue car right there. Er, uh, probably can't see me. I have a black hat on. Er, uh, give me a second. I'll take it off. Okay, here. I just I, I just ran back from the coat rack to hang up my hat. Yeah, this is me without a hat on. Those who haven't seen it yet. Which is very few people. Except some of my classmates, of course. Um, yeah, that's me without a hat on. Okay, let's get to the competition. Oh, okay. This thing is on. Um, yeah, there's two contenders. There's 2016 Camaro. Versus, of course, classic, but modern, Ford Mustang GT, 2016 also, and that, but it is modified, customized, and it, it has revised graphics, may, all made by Razor. Um, yeah. Well, this is a stock Camaro, of course, though, so... If you really want to know, it's on the new Speed Something's uh, Speed Champions, speed, Lego Speed Champions. As is with this um, uh, drag racer starter thingy, uh, it comes with the red Camaro and a 1969 Camaro Z28. If you watch another one of my videos, I'll have it on. Maybe not immediately, but soon. All right. All right. Yeah. Let's start with Camaro. The Camaro has a seven-speed transmission manual with a turbocharged V8 standard on the uh, stock car, and with the Ford. Mustang engine, standard supercharged V8. It's a great engine, and it's a six-speed manual. Yeah, that's all I can say about that. Um, yeah, this has sleek lines. Um. Wheels made by Rotiform. Low pro low prof low profile Goodyear tires. Great tires. And then these are made by Razor. Ecto one license plate. Uh Same, same tires as the barrel, and yeah, it's black leather on the inside, all seats are heated, cooled, whatever you want, strictly a four-seater. This one is a five-seater, um, I think it's gray, gray inside, nice Recaro, high back bucket seats. Say, same seats on the Mustang. Uh, Grant steering wheel, same thing. Some people might be getting bored of this. Let's have some fun. Uh, yeah. Not a lot of sunroofs due to unnecessary weight. Oh, ow! Emergency services, help! My guy is fallen. Uh, it's fine. He just had a concussion. He, well, well, minus a fractured leg, both arms, and nearly broke his neck. Um, okay, back to the cars. We don't need to talk about injuries all day long. Um, just looking at the two cars, I prefer the Mustang. It looks more race-like. The Camaro, it looks more like a big car that you would want to drive 
to somewhere where people would have limos and stuff. Not like a not like a family car, because it's a two door. If you had, if you have one of your kids, you probably want to get a big Chevy Impala LS. I used to have one of those. Uh, let's move on to the window glass. Everyone remembers that. Well, you guys should probably start learning about different car parts. Let's see. It's standard glass on all cars. Standard Chev glass. Uh, this stuff is ra strictly racing plexiglass. It's nice. Has a bunch of. It's thankfully it's ro it's ro it's street legal, so you can drive it anywhere. And they're only five thousand dollars more than the standard Mustang GT. Of course, you can't get it for real. This is just a Lego film. Duh. Uh, yeah. That's about all I can talk about with cars. Really? Uh, the winner. Let's just take it to the racetrack and see. And we may also have a collision course. Who likes two cars smashing into each other? Especially. Especially. $40,000. Chevs and Mustangs, the Chevs and Fords smashing together that satisfying sound of metal twisting and glass shattering. Who's up for that? I this sure is the am. moment we've all been waiting for. Which car is stronger? Um, yeah, it looks like the Mustang's stronger. Uh, judging from the broken glass on the Camaro. And the complete and the completely disfigured front end. And looking at the Mustang, it doesn't really look like it got in a car crash. It looked like it bumped into a telephone pole. Well, so yeah. It, did that lose a tire? I don't know. All right then. The Mustang won this this round. It's it's. It won two out of three. All right, so the last one will decide which is the winner. That truly matters because which one is faster? This is what this is what I do. Which one's faster, nicer, and stronger? Let's let's just figure, let's just see who wins this. The Camaro still has a chance. Alright, waiting here for the two cars. Oh, I think I see the Mustang come in! And he wins! Oh, uh, Camaro is second. Let's look at the results and we'll be back in a minute. Alright, hey dude, can you go check out the results? Um, I'll just wait here. What? You, you say the Mustang had a 9.9... .9 a uh, quarter mile run? Really? It broke, it, it, it made history now. The Camaro has an in superior 11.1 seconds, but if you like my videos, come back and watch some more. Uh, I'll think I have, I'll have another video up and running. Maybe a couple, a couple, whatever. I'll probably start one today. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Er, uh, oh yeah. Thanks, LT Latavia, for racing the Camaro. I got him to do that. I, I made a pro race to do the Mustang. Oh, if you've never met LT Thomas before, you should probably, he'll, he will be in my next video. So, okay, so. Thank you for watching again, and yeah, hopefully you got to know a little bit more about Lego cars, and uh, yeah, watch another one of my videos.
It'll be just like this, just different cars. Thank you for watching. I'm going to give you a little sneak peek of what the contenders are going to be in the next video. It's going to be a Ford Model A Hot Rod against a Chevy, Chevy Camaro, a 69 Chevy Camaro Z28. I'll have my brother with me to help me decide which car is his favorite and mine. And thanks, Dad, for getting me that Chevy, that Chevy Camaro drag race set.